There's a highlight along the edge of the glass there. Here, it kind of it's described with a line. Comes around this way. There's a highlight there. This front line, the front edge of the glass is an actual line there. Okay, see how it's starting to really take on a nice look. The, the idea is that we're trying to convey a transparent glass of wine and all the reflections and things on the glass are very sharp. Right. These values around here, going around the stem, same kind of thing here. There's a sharp line underneath, dark line going around the edge, back there. Ever so slight a shadow. Okay. Nice transparent base. Right? So you can see how I carried those values from my observation, right? Right into my drawing. Okay, it just dissipates the shadow. The drama in the drawing, the shadows provide a lot of drama. Now I'm going to push on that background, right? From light to dark, right? From light to dark. My light source is coming from the left to right, right? Okay. I want to, I want to, um, and now these shadows, they're just darker areas right of the same cloth so you want to treat them in a very very similar manner and the, the there's soft transitions right keep pushing on that Drawing right up to the edge of the light. Very low contrast, but there is a contrast back in the little square there, the head. Okay. Following and changing the angles ever so slightly. The space is going away from us, right? So we're, got, we're following that direction. Gonna get a lot darker and deeper, so I'm going to push this further away. And you want it to be soft contrast, nothing, nothing sharp in the background here, because it's falling away out of our interest area, right? So it's, Okay, so that's good. Now I can start, I really start seeing the light appearing in the drawing, right? And so let's let's deepen certain parts of the drawing. Now I'm getting into my little precision grip, um, touching in some very sharp 
when it when it's required when you're drawing glass glass is sharp and you have to draw with the sharpness right mm-hmm Always following my descriptive. Nice. Some of these areas are very tricky. And I'm always just gliding my pencil along there. Gliding my pencil along there. Okay. Ever so slight a shadow there. Right, and if we need B to open up that little highlight right there along the stem that describes the stem there, if need be, I take my kneaded eraser and I create a little sharp, sharp little edge there, and I can actually almost. I'm drawing with the eraser. See that? Nice. Touch that little highlight in there. Okay. Now I'm going to go back into the glass. Oops, I killed some of that highlight there, which is, I, mean, I can always go back in there with my, needed eraser, but I don't want to rely on that too much. a slightly darker edge there. Okay. And here it just kind of falls off. You can barely see any of it. Okay. Very, very sensitive drawing. Aiming for the hot spots. Okay. It's like a All the highlights and things on, on the on glass are very, very sharp.
start to darken some of these values here. Stem has a shadow on it. Aiming for the hot spots, always trying to smooth things out. Very sharp edge there. Just imitating what I'm seeing. from sharp, okay, and so forth. So let's now do some of this skull thing. All right. I can follow it either way. It's going away, plus it's coming towards us. As bright as it is there, there's a little bit of value on the forehead there. Right, so there's that center where the first tooth is split right along the center there. And then we have one, two, three. I'm gonna get crazy about this. And there's that, the bone that wraps around the, the teeth. Right. Okay, so now let's get those bottom teeth in there. Well, you can barely see the variation there because it's in the bright spot right and you 
can actually see how dark the background is, right, in relationship to the light size. It's got a long way to go here with this value in the background. And I'm drawing up to the edge of the light. And I'm going to employ my kneaded eraser a little bit to make sure I don't miss that little little bridge there, which is characteristic, right? And it kind of comes, it goes out and comes back down and in. Okay. So that's the light edge. See the way we're stepping away? Lighter, darker, darker, right? So creating the bend in the light, bend in the material. It's real dark up here. <laughs> 